So this is what my knuckles look like right now. Look at my knuckles. Are you seeing any dark knuckles? They're not dark knuckles, but let me not lie. It has not always been like this. Like I've had dark knuckles. I've tried to get rid of them and trust me, I'm grateful for the results. Just take a look. You notice that my dark knuckles have reduced significantly and that's what i'm going to be telling you in this video i'm going to be telling you the tips i'm going to be giving you three products that you can use and these products are products that you find in your kitchen they are very cheap so if you have them if you're dealing with dark knuckles you're dealing with dark elbows dark knees like any part of your body dark armpits you can use this on your body at least for seven days or four times in a week and you're going to see a very significant change but before i go on to tell you what these products are and how you can use them i want to give you some tips you need to know if you have dark knuckles or you're struggling with dark knuckles and you're using lightning creams yes you're listening you're using creams that are like lightning creams let me tell you what to do for some people after using these lightning creams there are two things you can do if you're using these lightning creams the first thing you can do is after rubbing your cream on your body applying it on your hands after like five minutes you go and you wash your hand this tip off but there is a catch the catch to this is that sometimes some people that i know that use this at a time like they may not be getting dark knuckles their hands like start getting darker like you know it's not it will not be as bright as the rest of your body so that's the catch to this one but it works if you're trying to prevent dark knuckles another thing that works is that after applying your lotion after applying your body like your lightning body lotions get that lightning body lotions and then start applying them extra to this part of your like you know if this part gets these are the parts that get darker you start applying it extra you start applying it extra to these parts of your hands like this part this part like Look at my hand right now you start applying them like very well you massage them in and then you might even try and clean this part and you come to these parts of your hands like clean them so that they don't end up becoming white it has happened to me so many times like these parts of your hand don't end up becoming white another thing is even if you decide to like wash your hands off just get a moisturizing lotion or you can get a hand cream like a normal hand cream and just apply it of like or just apply it all over your hands it's not going to lighten any part of your hand and it's not going to give you dark knuckles instead it's going to moisturize your hand and also prevent it from getting darker than any part of your body another thing you need to know is if you're struggling with dark knuckles and you know that lightning creams are reaching this your hands always apply sunscreen on these parts of your hands like after applying sunscreen on your face you apply them here let them protect them let them help to reduce the pigmentation these are tips that you can do if you're struggling with dark knuckles these tips i gave you like three tips now but these three tips are very effective and over time you will see how much they will really really help you to deal with your dark knuckles if you're struggling with them but now i want us to go to the kitchen let me tell you how you can prepare these three things that you will use and they will really really help you to deal with your dark knuckles they are very cheap ingredients they are ingredients that you will be shocked about but they work so let's just get right in the video make sure you listen to every instruction i'm going to try to do a voiceover i'm going to leave text instructions so make sure you watch the video very well and make sure that if you have any questions leave them down there in the comment section and i'll be there to reply you and if you've not subscribed to me at this point what are you waiting for we make resourceful videos so make sure you subscribe to me give this video a thumbs up leave a comment down there in the comment section if you have any questions and we're going to answer you so let's just dive into this video and see how we're going to get rid of these dark knuckles dark elbows dark knees all of them let's just try to get rid of everything so let's go right to my kitchen or let me just go and show you how to do it see you in the next clip now that we are in my kitchen you just need three things to make this just three very simple ingredients to make this and number one of them is your baking soda that is your bicarbonate of soda use it for baking it's not very expensive it's very cheap you can buy it from any baking store around you this really really this is like a bleaching ingredient like i know that i've tried this to like lighten my armpit and in so many other things but in the way i'm going to be doing it today is definitely definitely going to work to lighten every dark part of your body now the other thing that you're going to need you're going to need lemon lemon is another ingredient natural ingredient that really helps to lighten but it can be very 
triggering for people that have very sensitive skin so if you know you have very sensitive skin maybe you don't use lemon maybe you don't use avoid lemon lime you can also use lime for this process if you don't have lemon then the sugar is going to be the exfoliating ingredients that we are going to be using to make this whole solution that we are going to use sugar is going to help to like exfoliate your skin remove dead skin cells while still lightening that part of your body now the this is this is very simple to make there is no plenty thing about it you just need to mix these three things together your baking soda your lemon juice i'm just using i cut my my lemon into two like so i'm using one half of it and i'm going to use sugar and i'm just going to mix it thoroughly i hope you like do you notice the foam that came out from this solution when you poured the lemon inside yes that's to tell you how potent this is so you need to be careful while using this you can use this every day for seven days now use it and massage it on those dark parts of your hand you can use this underneath your armpits like you can use it on your armpits if you have dark armpits if you're struggling with dark elbows if you're struggling with dark knees use it and massage it on that part of your body this works like just give it time massage it thoroughly if you look at my hand look at my hand you see how it is then i'm focusing it very well to make sure using like this lemon like lemon that i've extracted the juice from i'm going to use it to ex to just exfoliate my hand very very well because i'm showing you i'm using my hand to demonstrate this for you because that's the main part that this video is going to be focused on it's focused on dark knuckles but i'm also telling you that you can use it for any other part of your body that is dark that you want you want to lighten apart from very sensitive parts of your body don't use this on the like maybe if you have dark ties like in between your laps if they are very dark maybe you don't use this or even if you're going to be using it be very careful not to get it to your sensitive area because i'm not trying to get you into trouble so you need to be careful but the three ingredients that we're using here they're very potent lemon is very potent with lightning any part of your body that is dark it is very potent your bicarbonate of soda and your sugar is just there to really really help you as i'm scrubbing this is really really exfoliating it maybe when you want to do your make sure that your lemon is not as much as my own because it kind of made it watery but if you can make yours to be a little bit thicker than my own then that would be nice then after scrubbing this on your hand for so long you're going to leave it on your hand for at the very least five minutes yes if you can do 10 minutes do 10 minutes but because it's a video you won't really know how long i left it on my hand but i left it for at the very least five minutes and then i went to the bathroom to wash it off and this is my hand after i was done washing it look at my hand trust me this is not something that i'm lying about my hand has been terrible i've dealt with dark knuckles for the longest time but thank god i've learned this method with some of the tips that i dropped in this video so if you enjoyed this video if you're going to try this out just do well to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to me if you haven't already now after doing this process i'm just going to go in with my moisturizing lotion it is important that you moisturize your hand after going through this process do not leave your hand dry and leave it like that if you have a hand cream this is the perfect time See you in the next video. Bye, guys.